Uh, first of all, I've got this little divot in the floor. And the nice mosaic that kind of looks like ghosts. Oh, look at this little secret room. Star piece. Shine sprite. Cookbook! Which is very good. And... Ice Smash. Also very good. So definitely check that room out. It's got a whole load of goodies for you. Let's explore a little bit, why don't we? So we've got two doors, a staircase, a statue of the Crystal Star, and we've got two doors up there as well. So what do we do with statues? Well, if you look at the carpet, you can see that it's awfully worn out. And that is Nintendo's way of telling you that something can be pushed. We've got another little lip. And what we know when we see paper peeling like that, it blows away into the black abyss. But secretly, it's just a chest of Flower Saver, which is actually a really good badge. Uh, if you didn't read what it does in the one second I had it up, uh, it reduces all FP costs by two, although I believe it's fairly expensive. Four FP, yeah, so... Could be better. We've got a very ornate looking chest, a locked door, and nothing else, so I guess... Let's open the chest, even though we never checked the doors upstairs. And a bunch of booze fly out. Mwahahaha, mwahahaha. Oh ho ho ho. Hee hee hee. Okay, it's quiz time, interloper. And my controller died. Just now, when the box opened, how many of us booze came out total? Well, fortunately, I was counting, it was 200 exactly. Good, very good. Take this, math nerd. See ya, sucker. And he gives us an Ultra Shroom, which is the best healing item in the game. But he also gave us irreparable trauma by calling us a nerd. <laughs> by me, calling me a nerd specifically. I don't know. I mean, I, I take it personally. Um... Sniff, sniff. Alright, well, we'll talk to the, uh... Uh-oh. Don't leave me alone. Alright, fine, I won't. Are you going to be mean to me? No, I won't be mean to you. Promise? Come on out, guys. And all 200 boos reappear. And they start swirling around in a crazy vortex trying to kill Mario. But at least now we can leave. And reveal the newest enemy of all time. Can you come out please? We finally get to fight the swoopers and also booze. So Goombella come on out and show us what's what. That's a boo. It's everyone's favorite ghost. Well, most everyone. Max HP is 7, attack is 3, defense is 0. It's nothing to write home about on the attack side, but it can turn invisible. If it turns invisible, we won't be able to hit it. So you beat it while you can see it. Boos are kinda cute, but I wouldn't want to meet one in a dark alley. If I ran into one in the bathroom in the middle of the night, I'd... Well, never mind what I'd do. Now that, of course, she means she would, uh, she would sing the entirety of Gundam Style. Okay, I thought he was going to suck my blood. Um, we've also got swoopers. So two titles in one fight. That's a swooper. I bet they call it that because of the way it swoops around. Wow, that's some awesome naming work, seriously. It's pure naming genius. So anyway. Max, max HP is 6. Attack is is 3. I don't know why I'm lisping so much. Defense is 0. It says here it hangs from the ceiling. If you can just damage it, it ought to drop up. It, 
Uh, it ought to drop off the ceiling, and then you can whack it. Just take a drink of water. Um, so that's why you would need the hammer throw. So boos are kind of like spooksters, they're like scarier or something. But it's okay, because that one's dead. Um, we've got more swoopers that I don't really care to fight. We've got big red switch. A Nintendo switch, that is. Got a staircase that leads up to three doors. And what were you expecting? Those doors uh, push you out here. So let's actually go down here and hit that switch for real this time. Because when we came in, uh, you should have seen the little uh, bone key or white looking key. Um, in the foreground. And if you had a very sharp eye, then you would have seen that the door in the back is locked, and um, naturally, locked doors require keys. So, we're going to have to be fast, because these boos are going to try and consume Mario's soul. Uh, they're coming. Um, but we're actually going to let them. Uh, and I want Gumbella back up. Because we prepare the spin and spin them away before they kill me. He says, he who he, you said you'd be nice. Let's get him, guys. So we broke our promise, and we did hit them. And we punched them, and we, uh... We bullied them, basically. And they combine into the big boo. So this fight is very optional. Entirely optional, actually. Uh, if you don't do it, then you'll have to deal with the boos circling you like they did that entire time. Uh, but fortunately, if you win this fight, then they will go away. That's an atomic boo. It's a giant boo made up of a ton of smaller boos. Max HP is 40, attack is 4, defense is 0. This thing will try to smoosh us. Our smush. You can also, uh, it can also split up and send hundreds of boos at us. 200, to be specific. And when we attack, it, uh, we might get so scared that we get confused or can't move. I sure wouldn't want to see this thing standing behind me in the middle of the night. Creepy. Is it that creepy, Goombella? Um, so let's see if we can get confused and show that off. No, because it doesn't happen. You're a liar. So, it can do this, where it just charges up for a turn. And not really that big of a deal because, as we know, it only has four attack. And if anything, I'd actually like it to damage me a little bit. Also, Luigi's in the audience. Oh, he's spitting out boost. Okay, well, at least we're down to danger. So that was actually entirely planned. I, it was a big play on my part. We can now also show off Yoshi's new move, Mini Egg. Oh, okay. Press A when let that lights up. Okay, I messed it up, but whatever. Um, let's... Let's try Power Left. Let's show off Power Left. So Power Left's kind of cool. Um, what you do is you press A on these arrows. And uh, doing so will fill up the bars on the side there. 
and when each one fills up entirely, you get plus one in a stat. So we got plus three attack, plus two defense there. Um, I'm not sure. Okay. The timing on this guy's attacks are kind of weird. Oh, he immobilized Yoshi. Oh no. Um, that's kind of not great, but it's fine. Um, let's shrink bounce with Mario. I was hoping... Oh my god, seven attack? Uh, I was hoping on having Mario... and Yoshi shrink this guy so that he would not be such a rude dude. Um, but that ended up not being that big a deal. They're going to give us a repel cape. How nice of them. Um, I think Mario should be able to just kill this guy though, though. Because he's in peril, so we do 12 damage. Bye bye. And unfortunately that levels us up and gets us out of peril. But so be it. BP again. And they all fly away and drop a very special badge, the Lucky Start. So let's see. This takes four to equip. I unequip Power Smash to put on an extra last stand. Uh, which probably... No, that didn't save us actually. Um, I'll keep charge P on, but I will take off regular charge. And put last stand back on. Um, and I'm going to equip Lucky Start, and you will see why. But Lucky Start um, is similar to another badge that we'll see later, but it's fun and just like good to have. It's kind of cheaty, but whatever. So is Danger Mario. Um, so, as you could tell from hitting the switch last time, or maybe you could tell, maybe you couldn't, hitting them moves the staircase in the room next to us. So we need to hit this one twice, because we moved it once downward, and now we need to move it twice upwards. Um, I'm also going to throw away this repel kit, because in the top part of this place, we notice that there's a broken gate. And we can get stuck on something. But past the broken gate gives us the yellow tree. And the yellow tree gives us the golden leaf. A very, very rare item, which I'm not even sure respawns. Because most certainly... Okay, stop giving me the repel cape. You can't just hit it again and get more. Maybe if you leave and come back, you can get another one, but as a kid I was always too lazy to do that, and so I never tested it to know for sure. Um, but the golden leaf will be used in making one or two recipes. Oh, good. So now that we killed the atomic blue, there's regular blues here. So there we go. That's what... Lucky Start does is when we s begin a battle, um, we get some random effect. And so there we got Lucky, which is actually a pretty good one. We can also get um, we can get Happy Heart, I think. Oh, thank you so much. Uh, we can get Happy Heart, which can mess up a Danger Mario play because it will heal you. Uh, actually, I'm not... Hmm. I shouldn't say that with so, so much certainty, because I don't actually know. Um, but various buffs can come from it. And it works in every fight, including boss fights. Oh, you know what? I entirely missed a star piece. Oh, well, doesn't matter though, because we're gonna get double coins. Everybody's favorite reward. Yes, please, thank you. 
Look at all these coins. Oh my goodness. Well, let's unlock the door first of all. Alright, cool. Oh, yeah, there's Happy Heart. Well, I guess I, uh, I guess I was right. Okay, we did actually get the slow shroom that he had. Um, I don't know if I want to keep it, though. Slow shrooms are kind of bad. Um, we are fortunately getting to a point, though, where even if we do have things that heal us when we don't want them to, we can stay in danger. And you'll see why when we get there, but that will become available after next chapter. So in this room with the stairs, in its default position, about right in the middle, you can spin the platform and get a star piece. That's all we missed. 